Hi friends, welcome to Excel Festive. In this video, we are going to see some interesting Excel formulas like advanced VLOOKUP and then substitute function followed by max plus if formula. All are very interesting formulas. See here, I am going to use the advanced VLOOKUP here. For example, if I am going to give the name, only the name, all the data from that array table is automatically picked up by using the uh, advanced VLOOKUP. And then what we are going to see is substitute function. Substitute function is nothing but to replace the old text with the new text. So we are going to see how to use this one by using the substitute function. And then max plus if function is nothing but here the data I have given right the city column here the Texas which is highlighted in the red color if I enter this one automatically the maximum sales for that criteria is picked up by using the max plus if formula. These are the advanced formula we are going to see by using this video. So make sure to watch full video we will start with the advanced we look up. See here we are going to see now the how to use the advanced VLOOKUP. See at the down I have given one table okay here we are going to find by using one single VLOOKUP formula we are going to get the four cells data okay I will let you know how to use that advanced VLOOKUP. By selecting the four cell I am going to use the formula equal to VLOOKUP okay and then press open bracket then select the name column the lookup value and then put comma then select the table array i am going to select the full table array okay the table from which where we are finding the data and then comma then what is that next is column index number column index number what you have to give c c o l u m n s columns columns open bracket give and then make sure to select the first two column okay i have selected the first two column only and then close bracket for columns columns we are closing okay and then comma then select 0 once you press 0 close bracket again to close the VLOOKUP formula then make sure to press you can also see here the formula bar you can see the formula now make sure to press control plus enter together to get the data see here you have to press control plus enter okay together so that see here the four cells also having like hash NA it will be available okay now what I am going to do I am going to enter the lookup value now which one I am going to enter now see here uh, column the red highlight highlighted name I have given here once I give column see all the four columns data has been automatically generated by using the advanced VLOOKUP okay this is very uh, easy easiest one and this will be most useful one see one more example I will give you I am going to enter the another name Zibril and the corresponding data automatically for four cells will be generated see here the same data has been generated right this is very useful and this is a uh, excel tricks also you can say this will be most useful for you guys none one more example I am going to give now see I am going to give Ali once I give the Ali the corresponding four data data has been generated okay this is how you have to use the advanced VLOOKUP. Now we are going to see substitute function, how to use the substitute function. The original text is given and then the another column old text I have mentioned and then the new text which going to be replaced with the old text I have given. Now I am going to use the formula equal to substitute open bracket. The text, text is original text. Which cell is having the original text? Select that cell, comma and then old text. Okay then comma and the new text to be replaced with the old text I have selected that one as well okay and then make sure to press the close bracket so that you will not have any error once you press the close bracket and press enter see here uh, the original text in that what is the old text straw has been replaced with the blue the new text and then output has been the modified text which we received is blueberry okay see here the definition I have given down the substitute function replaces ex existing text with new text in a text string okay now one more example I will give you same equal to substitute uh, put that formula and then open bracket then the original text okay the original text cell select that one and comma and then the old text then comma and new text to be replaced with the old text okay and close bracket and enter see here the in the blueberry original text blue has been replaced with the rasp and then the modified text we received is raspberry okay this is how you have to use the substitute function 
I am going to apply the same formula to other cell also and the, we have got the output. Okay, this is how you have to use the substitute function. The syntax is shown here at the down. It will be uh, you can also you can check it out this uh, syntax how to use that formula in the proper way. Next what we are going to see is max plus if function we are going to see. See I have given the data with the name city department and sales column. Okay, from the city whatever the city we are going to give okay, from that we will get the maximum sales by using the max plus if formula. I will let you know now see here I am going to enter the formula equal to and then max then open bracket and inside that you enter if and then open bracket now we are going to select the city column okay the city full column select select the first cell and control shift down arrow and the full column will be selected then make sure to press f4 to lock the rows and columns and then comma sorry equal to equal to then the left cell left side cell is the right i am selecting that one okay and then comma then what you have to select the sales column is the right click the first cell and then control shift down arrow the full, col full column will be selected press f4 to lock the rows and columns then comma i am giving the double quotation two times okay and then close bracket here after pressing the close bracket you have to make sure to press uh, control shift and enter together okay otherwise you will have an error and the formula will not be worked properly control shift enter you have to end, uh, end, press okay now i am going to enter here georgia see here i have entered georgia wherever the georgia is there in that which is the maximum sales only that has been picked see here i have selected two georgia and again and the third one is here in the from the three georgia city which is the maximum sales 95,000 that is picked as the output okay this will be useful for selecting the maximum value from the selected range now I am going to give the Texas once I give Texas see here in the Texas there are three uh, values are the three sales are there from that which one is the maximum sales that is uh, generated as the output 80,000 80,000 has been generated correct this max plus if function is also very very useful for you to reduce your time whenever you are using in the very big data okay i hope you guys are enjoying this video thank you so much for watching this video i hope you like this video if you really like this video please press the like button and until now if you have not subscribed to my channel make sure to subscribe the channel so that you will get the updated excel related videos and if you really find this video is very useful for you and any of your friend is using the excel please share with them so that they will get benefited from this video thank you so much for watching this video see you in the next wonderful video